Hi, it's me, Linnea, your favorite cosplaying cringe e-girl, and I am here to finally cosplay after not cosplaying for like a week or two. I've been so busy. Believe it or not, I actually did a lot of cleaning in this room. I know it looks messy, but I spent a good hour in here hanging up clothes and cleaning. All my hangers came in. Look, I've been hanging up all these clothes. Like, I've been hanging up my normal clothes, and I put them back here. So I still have more normal clothes to put away. So I'm taking a break. So I can cosplay and get out some nice cosplay fun content for you guys and for me too because I freaking I love getting into outfits and dressing up and taking my pictures and it's, it's a fun process for me and I hope you enjoy it as well. So without further ado, let's get into cosplay. I moved to my other cosplay closet studio that I have made in my house because the lighting is better for one and two it is a little more cleaner. Now if you look on yonder you'll see a mess so we're looking this way. I opened both of the packages just to take a quick look at them. They're in men's sizes, so I'm not quite sure if they'll fit me right, but I believe it's big enough. If anything, maybe a little too big. So when I put this on, I might have to do clips in the back, but this is the Miguel O'Hara cosplay. I put on this mask earlier, and it kind of smushes my face. Here, I'll show you guys it on uh, for YouTube. So I put it on. Here's the eyes, but it's just... It's just smushing my face, and it's not the best to wear. Like, I think it looks okay on, on the video and for pictures, so, you know, I might put it on for a couple pic cosplay pictures later. And Miguel O'Hara came with his little arm pieces in here. I haven't unwrapped them yet, so let's see how they look. Interesting, interesting. So, so I guess these go around the uh, this area somewhere? I don't quite remember. I will look at a reference picture. Here's the other piece. Nice, nice. And um, what's in here? There's something else left in here. What's this? What are these pieces? Do these go on the arm as well? I'll just look at a reference picture, but came with these picture pieces. Came with these pieces too. And for the spot. It came just like, you know, regular bodysuit. I think the painting on this suit is pretty accurate. I'm really happy with how the paint looks. Again, it is a men's size, so I don't know how it will fit me. It is probably a little too big, but I'll make it work. I'll use some clips. And here's the mask. And here is the mask for the spot. I haven't tried it on yet. I'm assuming it will fit similarly to the, as the other mask did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these cosplays both came from the same uh, company. I'll, I don't know if you can see, but it's kind of smushing my eye. Uh, maybe I'm wearing it back. Okay, this is better. A lot better. But yeah, the spot. I don't know which I'm going to do first, so I'm probably going to do one of them. And if I have time, I'll do the other today. If not, maybe tomorrow. I might do the spot because I have a Doodle Bob cosplay. And I think it would be funny to pretend to draw the spot and then the spot comes to life. But now that I think about it, I don't have a giant pencil prop to use. Unless it came with it, but I doubt it came with it. We'll see. I'll make it work. So let me check my Doodle Bob cosplay. And if the Doodle Bob cosplay came with the pencil, then I'll do the spot first. If not, then I will do Miguel O'Hara. So here's my Doodle Bob cosplay. I got it from a Spirit Halloween store. And I already see it came with an inflatable pencil. So maybe I'll put on Doodle Bob cosplay first. Take a couple pictures for fun. Inflate this pencil and pretend to draw the spot. And then uh, cosplay the spot. Make a fun little TikTok out of it. It's all about the fun. All right. It smells really rubbery. Oh, strong chemicals. And I guess that's what you get when you buy your cosplays and stuff. Making them. Oh, can I even fill this up all the way with like blowing it? I don't know if my lungs are strong enough. What? Nope. It smells so strong. I'm going to open a window in here or something. I put on all black to wear underneath because that's what I saw for the picture. And one thing I don't like, maybe it's the material, but it comes with these wrinkles. I don't think you can really get out these wrinkles. So, I mean, I wouldn't exactly recommend buying this. I just kind of got it because I wanted to do a Spongebob themed birthday party with my sister. But the costumes didn't even come in time. But, you know, I'm still going to have some fun with it. I want to go outside though and blow 
the air into this because it just smells so strong. I don't want my house to smell like this. So let's go outside. I'm just sitting in front of my house now trying to blow this up. It's actually not too bad. Like it's All right, I'm gonna use one of those Spongebob memes like 10 hours later. <laughs> I finished blowing up the pencil and uh, I had a couple neighbors walk by and see me, but I'm not exactly in cosplay yet, so I don't think they really thought anything. I hope when they see me, because I cosplay a lot outside of my front yard, I hope when they see me they think, wow, she's cool, instead of, wow, she's weird. I mean, they did think I was weird. It's not the worst thing. I just hope not to be like um, scary. I don't want to scare any anyone in my neighborhood. You know, I'm just a friendly cosplayer. <laughs> I mean, most of my experiences, or rather, all my experiences in my neighborhood, are people either don't really care that I'm cosplaying, or um, they they find it cool and they come up and say, "I like your outfit," or "I know that character," kind of thing. So it's been nice. It's been nice. me sick just looking at him. Those big bulgy eyes, that square body, those two buck teeth, and that stupid- Ah, oh, look at him. Ain't he a doll? All he needs is a tie. Ready for action! Bah, 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 bah. <laughs> show off my bare skin in it. I wear this doodle bob cosplay. Oh no, I am so heinous and atrocious for doing such an act. Don't worry, for I have a bikini. I hope this bikini is more to your liking. As per request, you know, always, always providing for the fans, so. In the words of doodle bob. Mahoy Manoy! So as I was outside, I decided to make more Doodle Bob content because I didn't want to get in the cosplay again. And I might have ran out of time for my other two cosplays. I'll try them on now, but it's starting to rain and I worry that these clouds are going to come in and I won't have enough natural daylight for the pictures to turn out good. So I'll try it on the spot cosplay and see how it looks inside here. If it's not raining yet, or if the rain stops, maybe I'll take my pictures and content outside. But that's just my plan. So it's the next day. I decided not to do the Miguel O'Hara or the Spot cosplay yesterday as it was raining and it was getting dark. So I might do in silk actually because I had a lot of requests to put on my silk cosplay again. And I do a live stream once a day of me just walking on the treadmill for an hour because, you know, exercise is, it helps me exercise and I don't realize I'm walking and I get a chat with you guys. So I view it as a good way to connect with my audience. So I'm going to do that now and then I'll get into my actual spot over at Miguel O'Hara cosplay. Lingonberry, what are you doing up there, huh? Maybe you shouldn't be up there. When you say it like that, oh, oh, oh. my live stream and I've just been hanging out with Jessica on the phone procrastinating so we don't have to work. Jessica has a dentist appointment soon. She's just putting yeah. on her eyeliner to be all pretty for her dentist. I'm trying to make stuff before I go because not for him. <laughs> 
And uh, Sigma threw up all over the carpet upstairs during my live stream, which I didn't know until I came upstairs. And now he's taking a big fat nap, and I have to go clean that up, which I've also been procrastinating. So I was going to cosplay, but then I found this like white dress thing I'm wearing now and took a bunch of pictures for Instagram. And I'm a little tired. It's 4.30, so maybe I'll do the cosplay tomorrow. I don't know why I'm so bad at getting into cosplay right now. For a while, I was on a roll. I was getting into cosplay like every day. Now it's just so hard. I don't know why. Maybe because my room isn't clean yet. It's still messy. So it's probably a big part on my like mental uh, tasks and workload that's just making me feel so tired. But I will end the, the vlog here. I guess this will be a part one of my cosplay vlog. So uh, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe for more content. I will see you guys next time. Take care, you guys.